Hey everybody, welcome to my channel, Vanessa DuBerle. I want to show you how to customize your YouTube name. Like right now, if you go in www.youtube.com backslash, it has a bunch of numbers to get to your channel. There is a time and a place that you can change that and put your name there, or you can put your business name, whatever you want, Some a favorite saying that you have. Um, so what I'm going to show you today is how you can change it and what the criteria is for when you can change it and I'll actually show you where to go to change it. All right. Now, before we do that, I have a special treat for you. I have new baby goats and I have to show them to you. They are half Nigerian or part Nigerian. I had two baby goats back in January and they're kind of docile and you know that those two babies don't jump a lot. The second set of twins that we just had about two weeks ago are jumping all over the place. I'm hoping I can get that on video for you. They are adorable. Um, so I just thought I'd give you a little treat. If you don't want to watch it, look down in my chapters down below and you can skip it okay so i purposely put that there for those of you that could care less about my baby goats but here we go we're gonna go see them now they're gonna drink from mama oh well you don't get to see them jump it's so hard it's just like taking pictures of your kids or your grandkids right Nobody does anything until you walk away. That's Addie and her twins. You can help give me a name. How's that? And I'll film them again. This one's a little boy. And that one up there next to mom is a girl. They need a name. Okay, so I came in the garage because Scarlett was making noise. I did not know if she was pregnant or not because in the winter they kind of get fat. And <laughs> she has a little baby. I'm going to try to get a picture for you without getting her... She's just delivered. Oh my gosh, see that little one? Look at that. Baby goat just delivered. And like I said, I'm trying not to get the mess. Yeah, it's just walking. Look at that. Just delivered. And right away, she wants to go eat. That's what they should do. Or he. We don't know yet. Yeah, this is Scarlett's first time. Like I said, I didn't even know for sure if she was pregnant because she was only a year old. And uh, it was hard to tell. Look at that. There's our new baby. Well, what good timing. All right, that's enough about goats. Now that we're going to dig in and figure out how do we change the URL or customize the URL for our YouTube channel. The first thing what I'm going to do is take you to my main channel so that you can see how, what it looks like where I changed the name. And I'll scroll down here a little bit. And you can see here where YouTube gave me, assigned me a number um, to identify my YouTube channel that came from them. Right underneath it says custom URL. Now there is certain criteria that you have to meet to be able to do this. I will go over that with you and let you know. Um, but this is what it looks like. It says Vanessa D. Berlay. Notice it says www.youtube.com uh, slash C slash Vanessa D. Berlay. And there it is. Now I'm going to take you to my other channel where I haven't done this yet. And you can see what that looks like. We're going to go to my um, Amish neighbors. This is something I've just been playing around with and it's already monetized. Um, so it's been fun to do. But what you're going to do is go into your channel. And then on the left hand side, you're going to see where it says customization. So go ahead and click that. And then after you click customization, you're going to see three titles at the top. Go to the third one that says um, basic info. So you want to go over there. If you haven't done those other things in there, you might want to go through them and get that all set up. Now you can see here where my channel URL, the one that YouTube gave me is at the top. And then right below it, you can see where there's two different choices. I can, um, two recommendations. One says my Amish neighbors and the other one says my Amish neighbors plus some information after that. Yes, you can go in and add what you want. And then you want to go up to the right hand corner once you select what you want and select publish and you've changed your URL. It's that simple. Um, when you go in now, you can share that URL with other people and they'll see that link and they'll know that it goes to your channel. If they see all those numbers and they have three or four favorites of people that they like, they're not going to know which one goes to who. So customizing it will actually benefit you um, when people save your link. Now there is criteria that you have to meet and I'll go ahead and put this up on the board after I share, but one, you want to make sure that you have a hundred subscribers. So once you hit a hundred subscribers and these following three things, you will be able to customize your URL. Number two, you want to have 
uh, be at least 30 days old, which wouldn't be too hard. It usually takes a good 30 days to get those 100 subscribers, if not longer. And then you want to make sure you put your profile picture in and your banner. So those are two things that you can do now and be ready. And once you hit those other two steps, you can go in and customize your URL. So not too hard. Um, I went ahead and put it on the board here for you. So Started a channel yet you're just in that stage where you're watching videos trying to figure out what to do I have a short video a, a mini course below and it takes you step by step on everything you need to set it up and yes it's out there you can google it find it whatever but I try to put it all together so that you could just go in and follow the steps and be done with it the second part is crucial it gives you um, it, I show you how I go and find ideas for my channel and it will give you that information and by the time you're done you'll probably have 50 to 100 ideas of what to do or what kind of videos to make before you get started and that's really important to have that list because I think the hardest thing is if you go sit down each week to make a video and you don't have any idea of what you're going to do then it's going to turn into stress so if you have it written down you have lots of ideas then it's pretty easy um, to put everything together all right thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed today's little disruption I know I did um, give me some names I need them uh, I, I'm brain dead on all the names um, for my little baby goat so help me out all right have a good one and I'll see you in the next video.